so hey there everyone that will be watching this video my name is Ivan and today I actually pretty fucked up uh, and I fucked up the Raspberry Pi 4 uh, the problem I were facing in my scientific circle we are building a bullet and we are using Raspberry Pis for controlling the uh, video output for the driver uh, to show the data from the engine, from the sensors, etc, etc. And then sending those data to our servers. And I try to uh, basically power it from the external pins that are not supposed to power the uh, Raspberry Pi because you bypass basically the protection circuits that are near the power supply and the problem with that uh, was that me being stupid and playing around with the laboratory power supply I set it up a 16 volt uh, power supply uh, it was a uh, not a problem, a mistake of mine that I didn't actually check uh, uh, I used another power supply uh, that should have supplied 15 volts but it wasn't switched to the right mode and it, it was outputting the 16 volt and I didn't check and uh, me being stupid <laughs> done this and I basically fried the circuit but after digging through the internet and not finding anything uh, that was my case uh, I looked through the uh, other circuitry that was on board and I'm using the can hat and a monitor uh, and 800 by 640 pixels and uh, I saw that uh, other circuitry such as uh, the can hat and uh, electronics on the screen weren't fried. The problem was with the uh, Raspberry Pi itself and mainly with this uh, diode that is here. Uh, it's not focusing, it's not a good camera unfortunately. but. Uh, the way I did it is uh, the standard, uh, basically, way just pouring the ethanol spiritus all, all over the place and s just cranking up the voltage. Uh, no other uh, no other way that I found on the internet uh, didn't work. So uh, I desoldered the diode that was here. Actually, I have it somewhere. Uh, unfortunately, I actually mm -hmm. lost it. Uh, or not? Or maybe yes. Uh, doesn't matter because I actually didn't find the uh, replacement for it. But uh, uh, I thought that uh, the problem can be with the PMIC uh, power management unit, but it wasn't. And uh, after pouring the ethanol over uh, over the board, I found out that the diet was fried. And uh, I wanted to share the knowledge. I know it's a lot of information that I was uh, cranking up on this video, but uh, if anyone <laughs> uh, tries to uh, do something like me, being stupid and uh, such, but we are just managing as we can and uh, doing what we need to do what what is need to be done uh, just first of all try to uh, find this diet and desolder it and check if this is the problem if not the other way is to as i said pour the ethanol all over the board and uh, basically cranking up the voltage you shouldn't be doing this through this to uh, find the problematic AC because uh, the, um, 
if this uh, IC is up and running, the PM IC, uh, it will basically basically lock the probability of you finding the problematic IC because it's uh, a power management unit and it will just turn off the voltage as if the uh, circuit is shorted. So uh, pouring it, you will. Uh, I'll suggest you to start from two volts and cranking up the current. Uh, as long as you need uh, to find the IC that will basically vaporize the ethanol and you will see uh, that some of the ICs uh, will do it faster and if you find it you just try to desolder it and replace it but first of all do it with the diet and uh, maybe that will be the problem so that's all I wanted to say and hope it will help someone so see ya